Welcome to a third set of practice SAT math questions. These questions can be viewed and downloaded from ck12.org. The average or mean of five unique positive odd integers is 73. If x is the greatest of these integers, what is the greatest possible value of x? So to start, to find the average or mean of five numbers, we would have to find the sum of the five numbers and then divide by five. But in this case, we have unique positive odd integers that have an average or mean of 73. Where one of the unique positive odd integers is x, where we want x to be as large as possible. So if we want x to be as large as possible, then the other four unique positive odd integers must be as small as possible. So let's start by listing the four smallest unique positive odd integers, which would be one, three, five, and seven. So again, these are the smallest or least unique positive odd integers. And the fifth unique positive odd integer is x, which we want to be as large as possible. So using these five numbers, we'll now find the average or mean, which we know is equal to 73, which means if we find the sum of these, one plus three plus five plus seven plus x, and divide by five, since there are five numbers, this must equal 73. So now if we solve this for x, we'll find the greatest possible value of x. One plus three plus five plus seven is 16, so we have 16 plus x divided by five equals 73. And now we'll clear the fraction from the equation by undoing this division or multiplying both sides of the equation by five. And since the left side is in fraction form, we'll multiply by five over one. And on the right side, we'll just multiply by five. So five over five simplifies to one. So we have 16 plus x equals 73 times five is equal to 365. Now for the last step, we'll subtract 16 on both sides. So we have x equals 365 minus 16 is equal to 349. So 349 is the greatest possible value of x. And because this is not a multiple choice question, we would have to bubble 349 on the answer sheet. I hope you found this helpful.